Hey guys, we're on a change out that I diagnosed last week. Leaking evaporator coil, old R22 pain system. And um, I'm using my Milwaukee vacuum pump. And um, this is a new micron gauge for me. We've probably been running This thing's probably been running no more than 10 minutes and I'm already down below 500 microns which means we got a good tight seal on the system I'm probably going to do a whole video just on that micron gauge I think it's one of the best ones on the market for a couple of reasons but um this is the setup I'm using on this this battery can run full speed like this for an hour and we're only 10 minutes in all right so we're down to 231 microns i'm gonna turn that off turn that off and watch my decay right now i'm at 229 microns And we'll watch it and see how it does. Two hundred and twenty-eight. All right. After five minutes, we're at two thirty-one. So I'm gonna go ahead and. Go ahead and put pressure on it. Let's turn this off. I like to put pressure on it before I ever put my Schraders in. On this one, we just need to hook up the drain, clean this up a little bit, and we'll be ready to go. Okay. I hope y'all enjoyed that little video. I decided just to put that up because um, it shows that little vacuum pump. If you got a tight seal on the system, it don't take no time. I'm gonna tell you like, when I showed it down like 230 microns, 15, 20 minutes tops, it didn't take any time for that thing to pull it down. I hope you enjoyed it. I might do a full review of that vacuum pump and the micron gauge. That micron gauge to me is the best one I've ever bought. Thanks for watching and I'll catch you on the next one.